We're here at the Cooper and Hunter booth at AHR 2025 with some very exciting updates about the refrigerant and humidity sensors for air handlers. So an A2L refrigerant or 454B has to have a sensor on the inside on the air handler. And so they have them on the Astoria Pro brands. And so that's going to send a signal also to the outdoor unit, especially on the multi-zone systems. You're going to have a solenoid where it's going to cut off the refrigerant flow. And you also are going to have this indoor unit running at its highest fan speed. The whole point is to not lose all the R454B inside the building. The other thing is humidity, right? Humidity is a huge deal. And this is a very huge update. Uh, for mini splits to have a humidity sensor so that you can lower the humidity inside the building without lowering the temperature, which means you're not accidentally lowering the dew point. And so this is a pretty exciting deal in order to have this now included in the Cooper & Hunter brand. The new Cooper & Hunter outdoor heat pump units for residential are R454B and also the commercial are R32. And those are the new A2L refrigerants that are required uh, to be used in systems. And now we also have on the multi-zone system six zones instead of just five zones. So you have even more capability in this unit and it's also rated uh, up to 100% of its heating capacity even if it's zero degrees Fahrenheit outside. New outdoor units from 6,000 BTUs to 12,000 BTUs all have the same line set sizes from quarter inch to three eighths as an outside tube diameter. So that's ACR copper tubing. The ceiling cassettes are now multiple capacity, and so there's dip switches inside, so you could set this to 6,000 or 9,000 or 12,000 BTUs, all as one unit. Even the slim duct units are multi-capacity as well, and so you could set this from, say, 6,000 to 12,000 BTUs, and as well, these are now medium static pressure from, say, 6,000 to 18,000 BTUs, and then they're high static pressure from 24,000 BTUs on up. The multi-position air handlers now come as 30,000 BTUs as well, and so those can be used as a single zone unit or even in a multi-zone unit. You can add in a wall control for the Astoria units now, and as well, you can control the humidity, and you set it on the remote, and you also have the uh, amount of fan percentage. So it used to be low, medium, and high, and now you can increase or decrease the percentage of the speed of the indoor fan. And for the air handler, you can also set it within one degree of the desired temperature. And so there's just a lot of updates, a lot of innovations from Cooper and Hunter.